Cell phones are ubiquitous in modern society. Everyone has one, and we all rely upon them for different things. Today, I would like to describe for you the five categories of evidence that police are able to obtain from cell phones. The third category of cell phone evidence in a criminal case is referred to as 911 GPS data. Every cell phone secretly communicates and corresponds with the cellular telephone network. And in order for an individual to receive calls, texts, or emails on a phone, the network needs to know how and where to locate the phone. Because the phone silently, consistently communicates with the network, the network provider can locate a phone on the network at any time. Law enforcement has the ability to contact a cellular service provider and order what is called an emergency 911 ping. This will enable the cell phone provider to determine the precise GPS coordinates or location of a given cell phone, which police can then use to track the location of a suspect or a criminal defendant. The fourth category of cell phone evidence is known as cell site data. Cellular networks are comprised of multiple cell phone towers, referred to as cell sites. And these cell sites record an enormous amount of information regarding cellular phone calls placed and received, text messages sent and received, and data transmitted using mobile devices. The cellular towers are also able to provide police with accurate information as to the location of a cell phone or a mobile device when it is being used, whether it be to send or receive a message, to send or receive data, or to make or receive a call. The final and fifth category of cell phone evidence is referred to as a data extraction. In connection with a criminal case, if police are able to locate the physical cell phone device, they are able to connect that device to specialized equipment. In using specialized computer software, they can often extract all of the data contained within the device itself. This can relate to call history, text message history, internet browsing and search history, photographs recorded, videos recorded, and much, much more. Cell phone evidence is becoming increasingly popular in criminal prosecutions. If you've been charged with a crime and you believe that the case against you consists of any of the five types of cell phone evidence, please call me for a free consultation.